lovers, it's Sarah, and today I'm going to be making a card using the brand new Scrappy Mom set called Lean On Me and their new Rick Rack and Chevron metal die. So let's go ahead and get started. I used my uh, Silhouette Cameo for this project, and this card is going to be a square card, four and a quarter by four and a quarter. I like to make this size square card because it still fits in a regular A2 size envelope. And this is Paper Tray Inks cardstock. And I am going to set this aside for a second. I have a mat of yellow cardstock that is 4x4. Four four, and I'm going to stamp my sentiment right up here at the top corner. And I am using the sentiment, You Are Not Alone. And I'm using Jenny Bolin Cough Syrup Ink. I'm going to ink this up really good. This is textured cardstock. I believe it's basil. And um, you just have to be kind of careful when stamping it. And hopefully it'll turn out. Very good. All right. Let me this off right there. Okay. I have some strips of like a turquoise um, cardstock that I used the rickrack side of the die for. And I just ran that through my cuddle bug using my regular, um, let's see, it's the B, A, and C plate. And I've cut three of them. And I'm going to adhere them right to the middle. Of this yellow piece of cardstock and then I'll trim off the excess. I think that looks about right. Okay, so I'm just going to add adhesive to the back of these pieces using my Zig 2A glue pen. Okay, so I have my three strips of um, Rick Rack glued down. I'm just going to trim these pieces off. And I'm going to save one of these because I'm going to use it again on this card. Okay, so there's our little Rick Rack strips. Now I have a piece of patterned paper that I've cut to 3x3 three three, and this is from Simple Stories. I believe this paper pad is called Snap Color Vibe. I'm not really sure. I can't really find anything else on it that looks like a title. Okay, and I have cut from the Silhouette Online Store a little sailboat and this sailboat is design number 10165 and I've sized it at 2.75 and let's see I'm just gonna start putting my little sailboat together on this piece of pattern paper okay and then a little sail Okay, so I've got my sails adhered, and then there's a little tiny flag piece, and I cut that out of red. I really liked um, the red with the blue and yellow. And then I also, since this is kind of a, like a card maybe for someone that's kind of going through something or you're trying to cheer somebody up, I wanted to add a little heart to the boat. And I cut out an Echo Park heart. It is design number 45088. And I sized it at 0.25. And I also cut that out in red. And that's just going to go down here on this side of the little boat. Okay, and then this 
other little strip of rickrack, I'm going to add down here to the bottom to make it look kind of like a little, you know, wave on my boat. And I'll just this was a, that piece from that strip we cut off and saved. Okay, I'm going to add this. And then we'll just trim this off right here. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and adhere this to my card base. Okay, so I have my uh, mat on my card base and then going to add, I'm going to pop this up on some foam squares to try to separate the, the Rick Rack pattern a little bit because it's in my pattern paper and on those um, strips. Okay, so I have my foam squares all ready and I'm just going to stick this like that. And then I wanted to repeat the pattern, the circle pattern that's in the dots on the sail. And I thought about um, embossing my yellow piece, but it just seemed like too many patterns going on right there. So I just have some little tiny rhinestones, and these are from Michael's. And I'm just going to take a few of these little clear ones. I'm going to add one to the little heart, and then one to the little flag. And I'm going to add Okay, so I have my little rhinestones added and I think that's it. I think that's all I'm going to do. Cute little card to cheer somebody up. Um, and there's lots of sentiments that would be great for the inside of the card. I think I'll wait until I know um, if I'm going to send this to somebody what sentiment would be more appropriate, but oh my gosh, you could use any of these for the inside. Okay, so I'll put a link down in the description box to the Scrappy Moms blog so you can check out all their amazing products. Thanks everybody for watching and have a blessed day.